So today is like a super stormy day. So we're staying home, taking down all the Christmas decorations. One of my last things, one of my last things is this big Christmas tree. We got uh, our cats, as you may have seen on some Instagram photos, are obsessed with being in our tree. And our last tree was really, really small because our last place was tiny. So we went and bought this big, huge tree after Christmas. It was on clearance for a hundred bucks, regular almost 500. So it's a beastly tree. So Jeremy and I are taking it downstairs together and we're just gonna leave it fully set up. Like we're gonna put it back together and just leave it without any decorations or anything over in like the furthest part of the house where we store our wood and everything like that. So we're doing that today while well, it's stormy. Does that base come off it or? I it? just unscrewed it, yeah, it should pull right out. All right. There it did, nice. Hey, they should pull into my arms. Yeah. Me. <laughs> oh, this one's better. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone didn't fall down, isn't it? Oh my goodness. That's good. Yeah, he's gonna try to come in here. Yeah, for sure. We have a baby gate there so that the cats can't get in there. Because we have this in here instead. I will show you this a little later. It was like my a, Christmas present from Jeremy. A detour. They can definitely jump and climb it. Yeah, they could. Here, should we put the stand up? You want to just set it up or just yeah. leave it there? No, let's set it up. That'll be out of the way. Don't you think? Right in the corner? Uh -oh. oh, dear. How many of those are there? Three. Three. Pile of wood from our hatch there. Mm hmm. Just huck it down. It's pretty cool. If we throw it in that corner, at least then it's out of the way. Yeah. And it's not getting <laughs> trashed by the kitties. Trying to sit out here a bit. Yeah. It's pretty high. Yeah. It's not really going to fit there with that. Oh. That's all right then. Just throw what the, the cup. What? There's a light there? There's a light there. bulb there. Oh. Maybe you need to switch it? The new bulb, yeah, it's just hanging behind this. That's random. Hmm. What were you saying? Just put like the first two pieces down then. Here's the first, oh, what did you set it down? <clears throat> Come on! Great. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll put that wood there. Yeah. <laughs> so big. Maybe it's not a good idea putting it together, is it? <laughs> it's so huge. Yeah. There you go. Christmas year end yeah, down here. Build the little room for the hot tub with the tree in it. Oh, I might sneak in there. Yeah, that piece looks little. Cool. This is my super snuggly hot tub. This is what Jeremy bought me for a Christmas present. 
And it's just a blow up hot tub, but it's actually really cool. It has 120 jets along the bottom. And I'll put them on and show you here in a minute. But I just blew it up. It, it came with like a pump. I mean, we bought this. This isn't like a, somebody sent it to us and I'm doing an ad for it. We totally bought this and I love it. So we just blew it up and we put it in the basement because it probably wouldn't do too good in our Canadian winters and we want to be able to use it all year round. So we have it in the basement on a cement floor. That way if we spill water, it's not going to ruin anything. And we put it right under a window. So when it gets too hot, we can crack the window and let some cold air in. It just makes it so refreshing. So it gets up to 104 degrees and that's what I have it at. And then it has a cool light down here with a couple different colors. And the bubbles, which I can show you. They're fun. It's pretty intense for a blow-up hot tub. So if you haven't seen previously, I was using this hot tub, link below, which is actually um, a toboggan or like a, so it's actually like a toboggan or a gear sled, but I was using it as a hot tub. <laughs> So after doing that twice, Jeremy finally decided I needed a real hot tub. I love it, and it's not big, but it's big enough for the three of us to comfortably get in it and hang out and relax. So it's pretty cool. After a hard day's work, it's nice to come and relax in it. <laughs> 